Thanks for tuning in to Steve Small Engine Saloon again. Do you have an engine that runs for two seconds and dies? Maybe it doesn't start at all. I got a really simple little thing for you to check here before you take it into a shop. A lot of times this is it. If you look at either side of your engine, see if you can see something that looks like this. It looks like a nut or a bolt that's just going right into the side of the engine. 99.9% .9 of these things have a yellow wire coming out of it. That is an oil alert system that you have on, on your engine. Some engines don't have it, but by far the majority of engines have that on there. If you don't see something that obviously looks like this, you don't have an oil alert system on your engine, your problem is going to be something else. If you see something like that on there, it's got a yellow wire coming out of it, you just verified that you have an oil alert system. Now, the point of that oil alert system is the same concept really as a float in the back of your toilet. That float goes up and down, it floats on the water and it shuts your water off. There's a float inside the motor that floats up and down on your oil. When the oil level gets too low, it shuts your spark off and doesn't allow you to run the engine so you seize the engine up. It's actually doing its job in most cases. It's amazing to me how many people bring it in and, I, and they give me their symptom. I pull the dipstick out and there's no oil in the engine. It's actually doing its job. So there's a simple thing for you. If you have an oil alert system on your engine, check your oil. You might be amazed. You might go, oh my God, there is no oil in this. Top it up with oil to where it should be try it again and there's actually a fairly good chance it's going to start and run again if it doesn't it doesn't mean that that's not the problem there are many times where the oil alert system on on people's engines are actually faulty either the float is stuck or there's something else wrong with it easy fix you literally unplug that yellow wire Unplug that yellow wire, you're going to see uh, one is a female end, one's a male end. The male end has a bare, bare part on it. Make sure that's not touching anything metal. Now all you did right there was just bypass your oil alert system. Fire it up, see if it works. Did it just run? There's a good chance it just ran now. You just verified right there that your oil alert system is faulty. There is no way it's worth tearing an engine apart to repair an oil alert system. It's just an option that's on your engine. You leave that wire unplugged, you tape up that bare end, leave it just like that. All you did was eliminate an option. Just check your oil more often. And that's as simple as that. Try that before you take it into a shop. It takes literally one or two minutes to check that before you waste money taking it into a shop. I hope I helped some people out there again as usual. Please subscribe to my channel as always. Till next time, Steve out.